I'm Dan Gukin, author of these books on Word, and here's today's Word Tip. It's rare to do, but possible. Here you see my custom tab on the ribbon. I built this tab using my most favorite frequent commands. All of them I use, all on one custom tab. To start my custom tab adventure, visit the Word Options dialog box. File tab, Options. In the Word Options dialog box, choose Customize Ribbon. On the left appears a list of commands. On the right, well, that's, those are the ribbon items. Every possible tab is shown, though some appear only in context, such as outlining. The list of commands can be broad or focused, depending on what's chosen from this menu. Popular commands, all commands, all tabs. I'm going to choose all commands for now, which increases the list size heftily. Still, it's sorted alphabetically, which helps. Now, on the right, you want to create a new tab and a new tab group. So click the New Tab button. The new tab is created along with its new group. All tabs must have at least one group. And the name New Tab, well, it's boring. I'll change it to Favorites, which is what you saw earlier. Rename, Favorites. The group is going to be called Home, which is where I'll put my favorite Home tab commands. So select it, Rename, Home. The new tab is created along with its group. The next step is to populate the group with commands which come from this list on the left. Ensure that the group is selected. From the menu, I'm going to choose Main Tabs as the category, which would help myself find the items. Expand the Home tab, and now I can add icons from the font group. Um, grow font is one of my favorites. Add, Shrink font, Add, Bold, Add, Italic, Add, and from the paragraph group, all the alignment options, clickety clickety click, shading, borders, add. And now I'm going to create another group, new group. And I'll name it insert. And from the list on the left, I'm going to expand the insert tabs commands and start choosing them. Pages, page break, and other commands, illustrations, pictures, Insert picture, of course. I could go on, but you get the idea. Now to view the tab and try things out, I know I'm not done, but I just want to see how it looks. Click OK. The favorite tabs shows up, marching along with the rest of the tabs on the ribbon. Choose it, and here are my commands. The look may not be exactly what you want, and this isn't what I'm going to end up with. Obviously, you saw that earlier. So more customization is in order, which I will cover in another Word Tip video. Customizing the ribbon includes rearranging items and adding more, changing their order, and hiding the tab, or even removing it if you're completely unsatisfied. For now, continue to build your own custom tab you know how, add all your favorite commands and settings all in one handy area, do whatever you want. Who would ever think that Word could be so fun?